calling the Bristol two meter net, calling the Bristol two meter net. This is N4NT. My name is Adam, and I'll be the net control station for this session. Is there any emergency or priority traffic? The Bristol 2 meter net meets each Tuesday at 9 p.m. on the 146.67 repeater. This net is affiliated with the Amateur Radio Emergency Service, the National Traffic System, and the Bristol Amateur Radio Club. All amateurs are welcome to check into the net. At this time, we're going to deviate slightly from our uh, normal net procedure, and uh, if all stations would please uh, stand by for a last call. W4KYS. W4KYS. W4 KYS. Stations monitoring uh, is my sad duty to inform you that W4 KYS, Tony Spit, the Bristol, Tennessee, is now a silent key, having passed away suddenly Friday, November the 29th, 2019 while camping in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. Tony was the owner and operator of Nickel Technologies Incorporated for over 25 years. He was a past commander of the Johnson City Power Squadron and past president of the Bristol Amateur Radio Club. He was also a lifetime member of the American Radio Relay League. Now we here at the Bristol Amateur Radio Club will definitely miss Tony and we send our condolences out to his family and we'd like to thank him for all that he has done for the club for the many years that he was involved. As you know, our Ham of the Year Award is named the Gene Stitt Ham of the Year, Amateur of the Year Award after Tony's father. Um, so Tony has been involved with this club for um, as a second generation and as a recipient as the recipient of this uh, award this year i would like to dedicate that award in honor of tony w4kys okay this time we'll uh, continue on with uh, net procedures i'd like to invite each person that checks in tonight if you'd like to share any memories you have of tony um, please do so it would certainly be welcome um, as we are uh, recording the net and we'll be able to uh, make copies and uh, any of his family may be may be interested in, in having a copy since we did a last call for him tonight all right this time are there any announcements or bulletins for the net Okay, I have one announcement. Um, after speaking to a few people and uh, realizing that there may be a scheduling conflict with the club meeting in January, uh, it was originally set to be January the 2nd. Uh, we we're going to move that up a week and have it on January the 9th, 2020 at seven o'clock um, p.m. Same start time and same location. I spoke to the liaison at the hospital and they're going to try to get us the same room we normally have but if they can't they will get us a comparably sized room to accommodate our needs so uh, we'll be uh, announcing that on the net for the next few weeks until the until that meeting takes place all right at this time we'll begin taking check-ins 
Uh, we'll start with mobiles and portables. Any mobile or portable stations that would like to check in, please call. Okay, hearing uh, hearing none, we'll go ahead and proceed on with regular check-ins. Any station that would like to check in, please call now. N4NT, please check in, KL1CA, no longer mobile, no longer portable. Okay, Jim, KL1ZA got you on the list there uh, from the uh, comforts of your home now. Uh, any other stations like to check in, please call now. Net Control, please check in. KD4, CCO, Dallas, Bristol. Okay, Dallas, KD4CCO, got you on the list. Any other stations like to check in, please call. KF4FHY, Kevin and Russell, in and out, please. Okay, Kevin, KF4FHY, got you uh, in and out. Appreciate you checking in with us tonight. Uh, any other stations, please call. Okay, let's go back up for some comments, and maybe we'll pick up a few uh, after that. We'll start with uh, KL1ZA. Uh, good evening, Jim. Good evening, Adam, and everyone else on the net. I'm glad I brought this in the house from the view outside my window. It is snowing here in um, downtown, outside downtown Bristol. Everything's going well, and hello to everyone, KL1ZA. Okay, Jim. Yeah, thanks for the uh, snow report. I've kind of been closed up in here in the, the shack for the last little bit and uh, without any uh, blinds open or anything, so I haven't uh, haven't got to see that yet, but my wife uh, just came in from a, a work dinner and, and uh, she had it uh, had snow in her hair when she had to run out in the yard and straighten up one of our uh, yard decorations that had fell over. I, had, I hadn't even saw that yet. But uh, thanks for checking in. Appreciate the uh, weather report. All right, up next we have KD4CCO Dallas. Good evening, Dallas. Well, good evening, Adam, and everybody on the net. It, uh, I just got a report that the ground's white here on Island Road, so uh, uh, the snow is developing. The temperature has dropped rather rapidly this afternoon. I know it was up in the 40s. Uh, middle of the afternoon and it's down to 32 here now so uh i don't know i think the uh, official forecast is one to two inches so we'll we'll wait and see what happens there uh by the way we will have the linking between the 443 and the 67 machine for the digital net at 9 30. i don't know i haven't haven't sent out any reminders so so we may not have as many check-ins tonight. So we'll we'll see what happens. Maybe we can get some snow report. Back to net control. This is KD4 CCO. Okay, Dallas. Yeah, I, I had forgot to or didn't get to send reminders out myself today, like I normally do. I did post on the uh, Bristol Club's uh, group page about it, but I uh, didn't get to send the normal. Uh, reminders that I occasionally send out on the uh, all the other group pages but uh, I've checked into some nets this week and actually linked them up to this repeater 
and uh, invited folks to come over. And I've noticed uh, a few nodes going in and out on the room earlier, maybe testing us out. So maybe we'll pick up some uh, some new ones, and and some of our regulars will be in there. But I uh, appreciate you doing that and uh, linking us up and everything. And uh, yeah, that net that uh, I heard you talking about earlier, that net that I had connected to uh, last night was. Um, that uh, net with no name part of a part of a group they have uh, nets three nights a week and uh, noticed they had one on monday so connected up with them they got kind of a unique format and uh, it's pretty neat but uh, the one that they have i think on friday night is a technical discussion but it seems like uh, each one they bring up some type of topic and i thought that was pretty interesting last night to bring up aprs and i was glad to see that you had uh, had checked in because that you could uh, contribute to that conversation. All right, that brings us to the bottom of the list. Are there any uh, any other stations that would like to check in? Please call now. Yeah, control. This is KE4DNU, Robert, Hills, Virginia. Hey, I have my mic at Bristol. Net control. This is Kilo Bravo 4, Sierra Romeo November, Walt to Jonesboro. Okay, that recognizes uh, KE4 DNU. Um, I believe you said Robert. It uh, come up different on the screen there, but uh, I believe that's uh, correct me if I'm wrong. We'll come back to you there. I'm going to. I'm going to change that on my net logger, so if you check in in the future, we'll have it right. Uh, K9MI, Mike, and KB4SRN, Walt, and Jonesboro. Any other stations, please call now. Okay, we'll go back for some comments. Looks like we have doubled in size already, so that's good. Uh, KE4DNU in Hilton's. Uh, good evening. Hello, my name is Robert Hilton's, Virginia. I was talking to Jim earlier, KLICA, and I was joining him, and he kind of invited me over. So this is kind of a test to see if I can make it in the repeater. I guess the answer is yes. Sounds like a good repeater coming out of Bristol. And I'll just tell you what, you sound like you're doing a great job calling a net. So my hat's off to you. Turn back to net control, K4D. Okay, Robert, thank you for checking in. We got you, uh, got you logged in there. And uh, yeah, if you uh, don't know if you have the uh, fusion capability or not, but we have a fusion net. Um, after this one either at 9 30 or the conclusion of this net if it runs longer so you're uh, welcome to join us for uh, that one i'm i'm not the normal uh, or the usual net control for the, for this particular net i'm just a fill-in um, for tonight and actually uh, i'll probably have next week as well we were I was talking to chris there he said he needed me to catch it next week but uh so uh, hopefully you can uh Join us again there in the future. You are making a, a good trip into the 6-7 repeater. All right, up next we have uh, K9MI. Good evening, Mike. Well, good evening, uh, Adam, and this is K9MI. Uh, yes, uh, I, I was, uh, you know, I knew about Tony and everything, and uh, I lost a friend. I think I might have been, I might have told you when we were going to the uh, Christmas uh, party that uh, I had a friend that was uh, not doing good in, in Indiana and he passed away and uh, I think his, his funeral was uh, Saturday, but he was uh, 88 and he had been a a uh, founding member of the club and uh, found out that he'd uh, even worked with my dad. So uh, we, he was like uh, one, of, one of my second dads. I guess I had a lot of the uh, second dads there that uh, uh, worked with my dad. My dad had a job that 
Ted Delco rang me that made his call this dog chaser, but he uh, he traveled around to all the different uh, plants. There were a lot of a lot of little plants. There weren't. It wasn't like one big huge one like we where we made cars at. But it was. Uh, 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 he met a lot of people, and uh, Dick was one of them. So his call is uh, his was <laughs> WA9STB, but he was uh, he was quite a guy. So anyway, uh, nothing real. Uh, uh, great going on lately. <laughs> we've, been, we've been having trouble getting Abby outside with the weather, so uh, I don't look like it's getting any better. So we'll see what happens. Back to you, Adam. Uh, this is K9MI. Okay, Mike, thanks for checking in. You know, sorry to you know, hear about your friend there. And, you know, I remember uh, discussing that when we were on on our way to the um, club dinner there or on the way back, whichever one. But uh, appreciate you checking in tonight. And uh, let's see, up next we have KB4SRN, Walton Jonesboro. Uh, good evening, Walton. Yeah, good evening, Adam. Everyone on the net, uh, good to hear everyone tonight. Well, we've got snow on the ground in Jonesboro. The ground is covered. The roofs are covered. It was coming down pretty good there about uh, 8 and a little after, but I don't see anything falling right now. Who knows? 34 degrees according to my thermometer, so it's a good temperature for it. And uh, we'll just, I guess we might have a surprise in the morning either way it goes. Anyway, good evening, everyone. I hope everyone stays in and where it's warm and dry. Okay, before us are in. Oh, thanks for checking in, and uh, yeah, that's uh, you, let's say you're right on the, the surprise there in the morning. Hopefully, uh, the I know here in Bristol, the schools usually uh, don't alter their schedule very uh, very easily because the city streets usually get taken care of pretty easy. And uh, you know, one good thing about it, the uh, my work vehicle now is all wheel drive, so I don't have to worry about driving somebody else's vehicle or or something I'm not used to. I just get in my own car and go and <laughs> all my equipment's there and I know where it's at and it, it doesn't uh, bother my OCD. <laughs> so appreciate you uh, checking in with us tonight. All right, that brings us to the uh, bottom of the check-in list once again. Are there any other stations that would like to check in? Please call. W-E-4-A-W-J, Emmett, Bristol. Okay, and that recognizes WE4AWJ, Emmett, in Bristol. Uh, Emmett, we'll go ahead and turn it over to you. we got kind of a, a short list running tonight there. Uh, how are you this evening? N4NT in the net, and everybody listening in. And maybe a special person out there that uh, maybe is listening for the first time on our scanner. This is WE4AWJ. Well, doing all right, Adam. It is snowing outside. It's not knee deep to a moose that's walking by, but it is kind of maybe uh, ankle deep to a centipede. Man, like I said, it may be a surprise in the morning. It's more snow than I expected already. So uh, we could have some black ice. Anyway, I hope not. But we spent uh, most of this week either in doctor's or dentist office, so uh, getting a day off would be a break. That's pretty much it for me. Um, hope everybody has a good week and uh, stay warm, stay dry. And we'll turn it back to net control. This is WE four AWJ. Okay, Emmett, thanks for checking in. And, uh, appreciate the the weather report across town there. All right, are there uh, any other stations that would like to check in? Please call now. Okay, before we take uh, one final call for check-ins uh, for this net tonight, just a few quick reminders. Uh, once again, the uh, Fusion Net uh, 
we'll follow this one at uh, 930 and uh, we will also do a, a last call on that net for uh, for Tony as well uh, since we have a lot of out-of-state check-ins we'll do something a little slightly different with that one uh, we'll try to broadcast that one on Facebook as well and, and make a recording of it also a uh, reminder if you're just joining us that uh, we did reschedule the January club meeting to January the 9th instead of uh, the second the times and, and all they are still the same um, and that was uh, pretty much all I had so I'll, I'll give a one last call for check-ins uh, for the Bristol 2 meter net this is N4NT please call now hey, for EJQ, uh, good evening no traffic Okay, Bunky, K4 EJQ got you, uh, got you checked in and out there. Uh, any other stations, please call now. Okay, does anyone have anything else for the net before we close? Okay, we had a total number of nine check-ins this evening. Thanks to each of you for taking time to check into the net. This is N4NT closing the Bristol 2 meter net at 9.21 p.m. and returning the W4UD repeater back to normal amateur use. 7-3 and good night.